In this video, we'll show you how to fix the error encountered when converting an MBR disk to GPT. This error occurs because the MBR partition table can only have a maximum of three primary partitions. To convert to GPT, you'll need to delete enough partitions so the disk has no more than three partitions. Please note, it's important to back up your data from these partitions before deleting them. Once the disk has fewer than three partitions, you can run the conversion command again. As you can see, the error is now resolved. Another issue you may encounter when converting an MBR disk to GPT is having the wrong boot partition. Even if you have only one partition on the disk, this error can occur. This happens because there must be an active partition on the disk before converting. To fix this, you need to create a small partition for the GPT boot files. First, shrink the existing partition and create a small partition using the free space. Next, open PowerShell or Command Prompt as administrator. Launch the Disk Part tool by typing Disk Part and pressing Enter. Get the list of disks by typing List Disk. Select the disk you're working with using the command Select Disk number. Get the list of partitions on the selected disk by typing List Partition. Select the small partition you created earlier using Select Partition number. Activate the partition by typing active. Once done, exit the disk part tool by typing exit. Now, you need to copy the boot files from the system drive to the small partition. Don't forget to adjust the drive letters to match your system's configuration. Finally, run the validation command again to ensure everything works. That's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and see you in next videos.